Evening all, welcome to is something I have been waiting for for a very long time. Now, before I get started, um, this is a an alpha still about to become a beta. And I've gone and bought the beta which of Elite Dangerous. Now, we'll explain Elite in just a minute. But firstly, I'm on a different mic. So hopefully this mic is not as shit as the previous one I've used. Uh, post in the comments, let me know. Um, this is actually the one I use on my PlayStation. But <laughs> not going to need that for much longer, am I? <laughs> so we are looking at elite dangerous and uh in this channel squad b was created to do generally anything to do with games to do with space space sci-fi that kind of thing and i think um all of this i guess has been from a funnel it's like a divergence in a particular moment of time in the past of a game called elite elite imp you know, it, imp it touched me more than that dodgy priest ever did and it just literally changed my life forever, less than that dodgy priest did. And I think this is why, to me, it's such an incredible joy to feel that this precious, precious game is coming back. Now, a brief history lesson, as we maybe just flick through some of the options. The Game Elite came from two very talented Cambridge, I believe, uh, alumni who created a game based upon, <clears throat> I guess, interplanetary trading, shipping, etc., and it was based upon the uh, you know, the kind of Pirates of the Caribbean era of privateers going back and forward and selling, you know, illegal stuff, good stuff, normal stuff, trading stuff, etc. And it, it just created a, a kind of a boom of economy, commerce, trade, but also piracy, combat, war and fighting. And this is being built into a game called Elite. Now, Elite came out on myself. I played it on the BBC um, Model B which shows a little bit my age but i was barely able enough to uh, to use it i used to watch my brother and my dad play it <clears throat> more than certainly i did and it was just such a great game and i i just remember it being infinite and it was fun it was it was unusual i'd never seen anything like this before even in wireframe now the game is <clears throat> well it's looking incredible let me show you um why um, before we do, we won't go into options and things like that. We're just going to go straight into the game. Now, currently, I've bought the uh, the, B the beta multiplayer um, access. So all I can do at the moment is do combat scenarios. I can't play the full game. Uh, but the combat scenarios, there's quite a few of them. We'll go through them. Um, but on the 30th of May is when the game becomes truly multiplayer. And there will be, I believe, five systems that we'll then be able to trade in. Now, the end game is going to have, are you ready for this, 600 million systems in the game. 600 million imagine that <clears throat> it's just going to be incredible i hope people are so you know excited about this game um it is it comes from a fantastic pedigree of a guy called david brabham who pretty much created along with um his colleague who i, I always forget his surname ian something <laughs> i was really prepared for this but he uh, those two chaps made such a great game and um, David Brabham did a Kickstarter and it was, it was it, you know, it wasn't certain he would get the funding he needed when he started it. Everyone was a little bit unsure. And what's actually happened is, is he's got the funding he needs and is actually creating a hell of a game. Um, <clears throat> so I'm, I'm really kind of excited for this. And I, I think, uh, you know, this is going to be something quite special indeed. So let's go through some of the missions. Now, I'm just going to pick the first one because, hey, let's just go and see what it looks like. There is a backstory and we'll look at that another time. That is a sidewinder. This is the, the, the kind of weaker of the ships. It's almost one of the weakest ships out there. It's also really small, um, but people would use these ships more as kind of combat piracy vessels. Um, but you know, the beauty of this game is that they're all being rekindled and particularly the Cobra Mark III, which is always my favorite uh, ship. I think the game is going to be huge and sprawling in its capability. The original game Elite spawned a game called Frontier, which was then, a, a, again, a huge, significant game um, as well. And I think what we're going to end up with is going to be a game of mixture of Elite and a mixture of Frontier, both of which created by David Brabham. And they're just going to be you know, thrown together and bang, we're going to have a hell of a game. Now, for those of you that care, the Oculus Rift will support this game. Already, that makes me quite excited. So, what you have to do here is you have to remember this is no ordinary sim. Well, it kind of is, but a little bit less. You have to understand that actually there is quite a lot of 
uh, I guess, piloting that you need to be aware of, okay? So <laughs> just remember that. And there is a, a fair bit to know there. And then obviously you can do all these kind of you know UI things and blah, blah, blah. We'll look at these at the moment. We're not even gonna bother. <laughs> we're not just gonna, we're just gonna go straight into it. So we're disregarding this warning here and we're just gonna go straight into the fight. And here we are. Now I've enabled mouse um, support on this, but let me just show you what I mean. If I go to options, there are actually multiple levels that you can have here. So you could have keyboard control more so than this, or you can just have absolute pitch roll, absolute pitch roll inverse and so on. There is a huge amount that you can do, but I'm just gonna leave it as it is at the moment. So it means that if I want to strafe, I go Q. See that? See the Christmas tree? See the Christmas tree? And if I want to strafe the other way, I press E. Hopefully you can hear these noises because they're awesome. Right, then to roll, I just press A and D. So that's A and D, and that's then just rolling or yawing or pitching, whatever you call it. Okay, now if I want to go forward, I just press A, no, W, and then it's S to, to retreat. So I can actually reverse as well. And I can reverse quite quickly, as you can see. And that's it, that. Now we have guns. So let's deploy our multi cannons. Now these guns are just comically bad. These are like some form of terrible, terrible Gatling gun. Ugh, terrible, terrible guns, but you, they get better, trust me. Now the weaponry is gonna be one of the key things in this game. I think it's gonna be quite astonishing. Now, the navy thing comes up to tell me that I'm actually gonna fly with something, so that's nice. And we're just going to put our foot to the floor and we're going to go for a little bit of a fly around this this very dangerous looking asteroid belt which is probably not the cleverest thing i've ever done um but hopefully you can hear the noise it sounds amazing it just sounds incredible i hope i hope you can hear it i really do it's just incredible and then as we kind of swizz round so again oh it's a bit close <laughs> Our little Christmas trees making noise, uh, little you know, little signs to show where momentum is. That's clever. Isn't it? Now let's just keep going around and let's just put the brake on. You hear those sound effects? Amazing! Oh, this is so cool. So there we go. Full stop. Now. We do have the ability to do certain other things, but one I'd like to just draw your attention to is the uh, is the console. So you see, we have like a map. We're in Zelda Two Asteroid Belt. So there is going to be a bit like Eve. You're going to have like different categorizations of of things. I don't know if I have a map. Let me just see if I do. I, I you know I don't know any of the keys. I'm just going to start mashing keys. Oh, hello. There we go. Navigation beacons. That's cool. Yep. I pressed H then. Let me see. Da 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 da. Oh, no. I think maybe F1, F2, F3, F4, F5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. No, nothing's working. So I assume at the moment everything's kind of locked out. But there is going to be like a full... And the idea is, is it's a full moving system. So this asteroid belt is rotating around that planet there. And, you know, the the planet is also rotating around the sun. The sun's rotating around other stellar bodies. That That is one of the things that they're quite proud they've done is they've created a true... A true... Um, you know, what you call it, uh, you know, science system around it, which is pretty cool. You will be able to do anything from mining to, you know, piracy. We are probably going to be pirates because, hey, it's elite and it's all about piracy in my mind. Um, but you could do trading. You could you literally do anything you like. And I think that's got to be the beauty of the game. I think that's certainly one of its its clever points. Let's just see how we go. So let's put our foot down. Oh, it just feels so good. Yep. So let's do a strafing run on these sons of biches. If you can't hear it, again, I do apologise because I've got the sound relatively low. The sound this ship makes is like a TIE fighter on steroids. It is so good. Here we go. Let's hit the next one. Back, 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 back. That's the Navi Beacon. That's the Navi Beacon. Oh, close. So let's slow down. There we go. Now, again, the, the game is obviously very simple and basic at the moment. There is going to be so much more. Oh, reloading. The game is going to do so much more. You're going to have full, you know, 
dogfights, multiplayer, you're going to... I mean, this is just going to be exactly what EVE should have been in my mind. This is what CCP always dreamed of when they thought of this game, is this this is it. And I think, you know, it took David Brabham again, the creator of the game, to really, I think, create it. Now, there is kind of an aim assist on, you see that? There's a kind of a mini... It's a mini aim assist of some kind. Let's just shoot that. Back, back, back at, oh... Oh god, I'm not the best at this yet. Give me time, bros. I got this like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> oh, that kind of hurt a bit. Did you see that? <laughs> that was brilliant. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm really loving it. Now, let me see. I probably need to slow down. The sound these engines make is just astonishing. It really is. That's not beacon. Yeah, that's not really gonna die, so where am I looking? There I am. Boom! And that is that, I think. And there we go. It's the simple stuff really. There is a bit of a story, but you know, bollocks the story. It's more interesting just to shoot shit. So let's go on to first kill. Now this is where we actually get to fight someone, so I'm looking forward to this. Now, again, the purpose of the game is you're going to have hundreds of different ships. You're going to have, well, I mean, I've done about hundreds. Probably in the end you will, but you're going to have all the different types of ships. So heavy kind of bombers. You're going to have things like anacondas, which were the huge freighters. Um, you are, I think, eventually going to have capital ships as well. I don't know, but I, I know that that was a big thing in Frontier. So I'm kind of interested with that. And you see the shields? This is how the shield system works. Right. Where are you, bro Seth? Where are you, Brolo? There you are. I see you. I see on the radar. What we need to do is just rotate, get him in there. Get our guns open. Say goodbye. Oh my god, this is amazing! What's happening? <laughs> Got Lazarus. Lazarifil. Oh my god. Oh, you see that? He took damage, he took damage. Oh, no you didn't. He called me a spaced, crazed psycho. I don't know if I'm crazed on space. I'm being shot, I'm being shot, I'm being shot. Let's do a full stop. We slow down, because obviously you want to try and slay speed. And there we go, there you are, sir. Come here, you bitch. <gasps> Look at the trails in that gorgeous. Oh god, I'm terrible at this. Maybe I actually should get a joystick for this. Never thought I'd need one of them again. That's right, bitch. Bring it, bitch. Oh, in the face. Oh god. No, I don't know how I... There we go. So I know that he's now on armor. Ooh, one more hit, sir, and you're done. Now, I'm just going to let him faff about while I kind of follow him. Just I want to enjoy the the spectacle. So, look at this. The ship trails are good. Oh, it just looks so good, doesn't it? This is so good. Now, again, you're going to have missiles. You're going to have artillery cannons, rail guns. You're going to have beam lasers that just go continually. Oh, it's going to be good. Oh, look at Oh, he's so good. Ooh, zero hull. Oh, and he's down. Downtown. So let's start. Let's see if we can pick up his corpse and do things to it. Nope, we can't. Oh, this is good. I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying this. Now, imagine this multiplayer. How the hell is that going to work? I just can't imagine it. Uh, it's just, yeah, I literally cannot imagine what it's going to be like with like 20, 30 people fighting in this kind of thing. Oh, it's going to be good. Now, it will have lag. You're always going to have lag, unfortunately, but I just, oh, I'm excited. Seriously excited right now. So here we go. This is now, what's it called? Locate and destroy the Crimson Triumph. I'm not sure what that means. This guy knows what he's doing. <clears throat> Right, so you can divert stuff, but again, I don't know how. <laughs> I'm just going to not bother with it, because YOLO. And let's go find him. Where are you, dude? Where are you, bro? Look at that planet, it's pretty good, isn't it? Weapons out. There he is. 
Oh, you got broke sack. Oh, 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 no, you didn't. Let's keep the power down. As we kind of skeet around. Oh, he's not bad, you know. He's, he's on my ass. In a kind of very bad way. There we go. I have you now, Skywalker. What's that shield? There we go. Oh my god, I keep losing it. Still getting used to this whole mouse stuff. I probably shouldn't be using the mouse. Oh god, this is good. Oh, I just ate this shade of coolant. More meat for the grinder. <laughs> you, sir, go down. That's right, that's right, oh yeah, oh yeah. How's your hull now? Oh, come on, cool down, cool down, cool down. Cool down, God, cool down. Uh-oh, is he running? He's recharging, God damn it. Shield almost up. Is that? See that? See the little bubble? Isn't that amazing? I love it. I'm smitten. I'm smitten. I've fallen in love. This game is brilliant. Already, I'm loving it. Now, what I used to do, I used to literally just run computers and food from uh, was it Lav and Zeon? That's all I did. I was a bit of a girl back then. Oh yeah! Come on, Daddy. Come on. Cool down, cool down, god damn it. God damn it. God, you have to be careful with these lasers. Oh, shield is gone, my friend. But I wish these lasers would cool down a bit more. This is where some form of belt, belt fed chain gun is probably going to be not a bad idea, actually. Use the lasers to knock the shield down. And then maybe a railgun or something. God, this is difficult. Always overloading. I'm kicking his ass though. Surge detected me, no wonder. Oh, he's on fire! 47%. Oh, you son of a bitch, stop fucking overheating. It's tricky, not easy. It's a bit of war thunder and Eve going on here. Oh, yeah. Damn, I always had him. Oh, this is it's fun. It really is fun, I can tell you, but it's not easy. It's not easy at all. I reach out and touch you. What? Hello? I'd rather you didn't, sir. Oh, come on. That's right. Oh, we just boosted away. Nice. I actually don't know how I boost, I haven't worked that out yet. I should work these things out, I'm not the kind of guy that reads a manual before I play a game. I never do, rarely do tutorials, but rarely, seriously, I mean rarely do it. Come on, cool down. I bet others have killed this thing in like seconds, I'm here. Oh, 23. You feel like you earn your kill. That has got to be one of the nicer things about it, is you feel you're actually uh, working to earn your kill. And that is quite rare. It feels like there's a human in that, if I'm honest with you. This is just an NPC, but it's like that. It actually feels quite good. See, that's it. That's it. That's it. 
Pô, mas não ia. Trolls, yeah. God, I'm enjoying this. I hope you can hear it in my voice. I really am enjoying this. This is good. Right. Weak on wings. Right. Federation ships. Ooh, nice. I don't know who these guys are. I don't know what the story is. Don't really care, to be honest. I think when the game comes out, I'm just going to become, you know, CO Pirates, Dread Pirate. And just literally fight and kill and rape and pillage and kill and rape and pillage and kill and rape and rape and kill and rape. And maybe with a bit of rape. We'll then kind of uh, rape our way across the stars, killing things and pillaging <laughs> and stealing and looting and rape as well. It's going to be fun. Oh, hard points. I wish I knew how any of this worked. I actually don't know. In fact, let me try and figure it out. Um, no. Mm. Do you know, I just don't know. Small missiles. Interesting. Well, there's our target. What's up, buddies? I don't know what's happening there. We'll find out in a minute. Whoa! Did you see that? Did you see that? that I don't even know what that is. Uh oh, this is probably not going well for me. Oh my god, that's auto targeting. Sweet! I have guns that are cleverer than me. Oh god. This is amazing. Just need to speed a little bit. Maybe I'm too whizzy. Ugh. I'll tell you what, turning is not easy with the mouse. I can't say I'm a fan of the mouse actually, I think the mouse may need to go, but eesh, we'll see. Let's just slow all the way down. Right, shields fight, what? What, what, what? what? Hey, ooh, whoa, whoa! Easy now. Oh no! Oh, are you kidding? I don't know what's happening. I think I'm being shot by many, many things, but I actually can't get a shot on them. Oh god, 15! No! But my buddy just paid for that Christmas tree. Uh, yeah, this is not going to end well. I don't know how you boost away. Oh, shields up. Shields up, yeah. Oh, I just, do you know what? I can't, I, I need to do a full stop and spin, because I am just going round and round. Bye, right, bitch! Suck it. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Trying to dodge and weave. It's not working. 10% hole, 9. No, 7. No, but precious, precious sidewinder. Ah. Can I, can I get out? Can I eject? <laughs> Ugh. No. No! It's not looking good. I'm dead. So there we go. This is just an amazing game. I am loving it so much. I hope you enjoyed this. We're going to bring you a lot more of this. I think a new series is born. <laughs>